As with many metal joining applications, the use of flux is vital to help protect the joint from oxidation as well as to help the metal wet out and flow into the joint. Here I'm just using my soldering iron and a tiny bead of solder to tack down the two opposite corners of the part. And then I'm going to get a little bead of solder on the end of my iron and then just run it along the leads. Now this board does have a solder mask, that green layer on the top, which helps with keeping the solder from bridging between the leads. But you can use this same technique on a homebrew circuit board and it works just fine. Uh, you may just have to be a little more careful and, and look and clean up any bridging that might happen between the leads or flowing along traces. Here I'm using a water soluble flux, so it's just a matter of cleaning it up with water and drying it and I'm ready to go.